Hey Barflies, welcome back to another episode of Behind the Bar Liquor Reviews, although tonight's not really a liquor review. But it could go with liquor, possibly. Late Night Munchies, where we review snack foods while you're drinking at home, or bar foods while you're out at the bar drinking. You have to bring this with you. No, I don't think there'll be other foods that will be... I don't think a bar is going to be selling 7-Eleven chips. <laughs> no. And these, spectacularly, are the Big Bite Hot Dog 7-Eleven chips. Supposedly these are flavored like a big bite hot dog. I don't know if it has it ketchup, ketchup relish, any of that stuff. But, uh, <laughs> you can put ketchup in relish on it. Tastes just like those metal rollers. <laughs> oh, it smells like hot dog. Yeah. Oh, it's shocker. It, Imagine that. Just a it chip with looks some nothing like a hot dog. It doesn't look like a hot dog. We should squirt some ketchup in there. I don't smell hot dog. I'm trying to get a hot dog. I'm good. Wow. I guess he's not waiting to, for all of us, so. We get so a cheers. Cheers. Oh, we get a cheers with the oh, cheers. Oh, yeah. just think about it. Cheers. Yeah. I don't really get hot dog. I get like relish. It's not bad, actually. <laughs> yeah. I'm getting like hot dog toppings. Yeah. yeah. Ketchup it's not bad. Relish. It's like a white barbecue chip with ketchup and relish. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Maybe some mustard in there. There's a little bit of spiciness. Yeah. Definitely some mustard. But that's not bad. So it's know. all the condiments minus the hot dog. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> of course, at a 7 Eleven. You want to put as many toppings on it as you can to cover the to kill the taste of that <laughs> disgusting hot dog. We've been rolling around for a few hours, you know. <laughs> These are not half bad. No, they're not bad. So if you are sitting at home and you're drinking, or you have the munchies, or for anything whatever you have, reason, medically, and you feel the need to eat a potato chip that tastes like uh, ketchup, <laughs> mustard, relish, and maybe a little bit of hot dog that have been rolling around in rollers for three hours, that's really that's, that's, that's the that's not bad at all. I think it's not bad either. It was two dollars and thirty nine cents in our local lot, Seven Elevens. So, what are you rating, the Big Daddy? Oh God, as chips go, I will give that a seven. Wow. Twink. I was gonna say a five. I'm gonna say I'm gonna go five. You don't change because of me. No, I'm not. <laughs> I'm thinking those are pretty freaking tasty. Pretty good. Good. I, I like that the mustard spice, the relish, yeah, and the yeah, ketchup. It works. I'm going an, an eight on that. That's good. I really thought it was going to be disgustingly close to a hot dog taste. It's really not. But yeah, it is good. That is good. Yeah, they just call it hot dog uh, topping flavor. I don't know if I eat a lot of those. Like it's it's all right, but it's just I, that's a, there's a lot going on for a chip. <laughs> <laughs> Too much going on for a chip. There right? is. Like, I love like salt and vinegar. I'm a huge oh, yeah. fan of. There's not a lot going on there? Well, there is, but there's not relish and ketchup. By the way, my favorite, favorite, my favorite salt and vinegar chip, even though it's not technically a chip, is Pringles. Their really? salt and vinegar really? is freaking awesome. See, I like the Cape Cod salt and vinegar. I don't like those. Well, I mean, I like them, but I, the Pringles, the Pringles I like. flavor is so good. But you know what? You know which ones I like? And I know our cameraman, Tin Man, is going to totally agree. Wegmans brand salt and vinegar. Yeah, really? It's rich, it's rich chips with the salt and vinegar. Yeah, but the ridges do help. That yeah, have ridges. Yeah, that's that's why I kind of it kind of kick itself up a little bit. I will yeah. say this: I'm an Utz's guy, though. Utz's are good. Love good. Me some Utz's chips. Um, so I think I've been kind of spoiled by that because Utz's has got a lot of flavor on their chips. They do actually. They're pretty good. Well, you know what? Stop by your uh, local 7-Eleven, pick these up. We all gave them pretty decent reviews. Let us know if you've had them before or if you're going to try them. Don't forget to like the video, share it, subscribe, all that fun stuff. Our links to our Facebook and our Twitter are going to be right below us. And uh, have a good night, everyone. How are they going to be up? Ah! <laughs> what are you, a Dude! <laughs> should, we, should we scrap the food? Look at that, you it to your face. Let me give you the lowest rating. Thank you.